Hello, everyone. Well, without even trying, it seems that Long Grove, Illinois, and in particular the Long Grove Bridge, has become a staple to my channel. The unexpected saga of the Long Grove Bridge has become somewhat of a series to my channel. In the last video, you saw that the Long Grove Bridge was destroyed when a truck unlawfully went through it. Well, since then, we have received confirmation that they are going to rebuild the bridge. And we also learned that a temporary structure was put up to allow traffic to continue to flow through. So today, we are back in Long Grove to check out the structure, and honestly, it is not quite like I expected. Let's check it out. And there you go. This is something that I never thought I would see in my lifetime. This is the new Long Grove temporary one lane bridge. So there you go. Now honestly I thought they were going to clean up a lot of the debris and leave most of the existing structure, just make it safe enough for traffic to go through. But that clearly was not the case. These new yellow bars are in place, which are obviously for height restrictions. And basically, these steel beams and the road itself is all that is left of the existing bridge. Lots of traffic cones are in place. My guess is to keep the cars from hitting the side beams. But Speaking of construction cones, there is a lot of construction going on right now in Long Grove, and I'm going to show you a little bit of that, too. But there is some remnants of fall and Halloween still around Long Grove as well, including this little pumpkin tree, which is made out of a ladder and some wood boards. That's kind of neat. This is the nature trail that I've walked down a few times in some of my vlogs. There is a trail marker here now that I don't remember seeing before. So I guess it's officially called the Covered Bridge Trail. And as I so often do, here is a look at the bridge, such as it is, from the creek. Now, to the best of my knowledge, they are still planning to restore the bridge. But based on what I see today, the question now is how much is this new structure going to look like the old structure? The covered bridge and its design is quite the staple to Log Grove, and it is on about every logo that is related to Log Grove. So it wouldn't make sense to change it, modernize it, that sort of thing. It really needs to keep the look while still being a safe structure, 
to fit you know the iconic cover bridge logo that is all over Long Grove so this is going to be very interesting to see there may be a design out I haven't really looked yet I'm definitely going to dig more into it and of course I will be back here as I've been doing so many Long Grove Bridge videos now I definitely have to come back and uh, see the progress um, I expect that there will probably be by next spring there will probably start to work on it more when it starts to get warm again. Uh, we shall see. Now currently Long Grove is in a sort of renovation phase. They are starting to modernize and renovate some of the buildings. And one of the big things they're doing now is renovating the roads. Throughout downtown Long Grove, a lot of businesses have closed over the years. Here's a few over here. But let's walk through downtown a little bit. Of course they have up all the classic Halloween related scarecrows. This is some sort of annual contest I believe. Sometimes I wonder if I'm in Long Grove with these closed businesses and no covered bridge. Just along this strip here, this Viking Treasures gift store is the only one that is open along here. This one has my vote. Even Elvis has left this Long Grove building. And it's just one empty building after another. Very sad. But, as you can see, they are busy with construction here. These roads are quite a mess to drive through, apparently. And you can actually only go one way on Old McHenry Road, currently. So you have to take a long detour around it's just quite a mess, and honestly, I'd recommend not even bother trying to drive through here, although lots of people are. If you're going to visit the stores, park on the outside and just walk through. It's a lot easier right now. Yeah, it seems like they are trying to rebuild Rome here. So not only is this a one-way road, This is a two-way road, but then I think it turns into a one-way road going this way. And it's also part of the Robert Parker Coffin detour, so it's just a complete mess. They actually take you this way a little bit and then turn down one of the side streets to get to the other road. It's just kind of crazy right now. I'll just say that. More abandoned stores here as well. I'm not sure what, if anything, is open along this area. Maybe they are just closing this town down <laughs> until uh, they finish the road renovations. Obviously they're not closing down the entire town. They are still having their chocolate fest, strawberry fest, and I believe apple fest. Um, I haven't gone to one of those in quite a few years, but I know those are still happening here.
even the ATM is shut down. It's just so weird to see it so quiet here. Now it is fall, it's not like the peak summer season, but it is still just so quiet, so it feels like a ghost town, honestly. And it's really weird for me to say that, being in Long Grove. Looks like Patty's is doing well and has the Irish music playing. So, what do you think about the current state of Long Grove? With all the closed slash renovating businesses, the road construction, and the lack of a covered bridge. Comment below, let me know what you think about the future of Long Grove. What do you think it will be? Now, I'm generally an optimistic person, and I am looking forward to seeing where all the construction is done, how many businesses reopen, and I do hope that Long Grove has a bright and prosperous future. And a lot of these little towns, of course, with online shopping and stuff, eventually die down, but Long Grove is a little different. It is quite a staple here in Lake County and gets visitors from all over Chicagoland. So I really definitely hope it comes back and I will be back. I'm going to check this out, check the progress. I'll be back vlogging again here. Thank you for watching. Um, I do have a Long Grove playlist up on my channel now if you want to check out all the previous videos and see how the bridge used to look, definitely check out the playlist, check out my previous videos. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and check out Memories by Wayne on Facebook and Instagram as well. Thank you for watching.